The following contest is a gauntlet eliminator match! The rules of the match are as follows. Two superstars will start in the ring. At regular intervals, a new superstar enters the match. Elimination can occur anywhere in the arena! The match continues until one superstar remains, and that superstar will be declared the winner! Great. You know, I have something I need to say about... Shh. It's Chelsea. And from Victoria, British Columbia, Canada, Chelsea Green! You know, I actually heard that Chelsea Green is the kind of person that'll order a huge salad, eat the whole thing, and then complain to the manager that something was wrong with it. Um, that's not out of the ordinary. It's like wrestling a great match and then learning afterwards that you, Byron, did commentary on it. <sighs> Maybe after Chelsea gets the win tonight, the general manager will finally recognize her talents. crashed the party and taken the women's division by force. And Bailey now has more muscle by her side than ever. Bailey claims that the locker room needs to learn that the world does not revolve around them. Because it's the role model's world and we're just living in it. Do we have to? Everybody's excited for Bailey to compete here tonight. Well, except for Cole. I love seeing her compete. I just can't stand it when she talks. There's the battle in this Falls Count Anywhere match. Is <gasps> Bailey shot to the left. <laughs> Is Bailey Cook? Oh man, forget the count. She's got more punishment in mind. Oh, come on now. Bailey is just hamming it up for the crowd. Cole, please don't give Bailey a reason to come over to our desk. For someone who claims not to care about the idiots in the crowd, Bailey's sure spending a lot of time trying to get a reaction out of them right now. Bailey turning her attention to the crowd. A little ding dong hello for anyone not paying attention. What's she looking for under the ring? Oh boy, she's got Lechonkla. Business just picked up. And would you look at that? She knew exactly what she was looking for under there. Corey, gauntlet matches can be so unpredictable. Is there any real strategy here, or is it really something where you just have to kind of play it by ear? Well, luck's obviously a major part of a gauntlet match, Cole, especially when it comes to your entry number. But like with any other match, there are still major keys to success. Gauntlets are ultimately about stamina. If you're one of the first two competitors, you're going to need a lot of it. She's on 
unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Things went from bad to worse. She has other plans here. I think she was just looking to soften her up a little there. Able to reverse that one. Head butt in the back of the neck. We are seeing a lot of guts, a lot of determination out there. You have to wonder where that one turning point to end this will come from. Just one step ahead. Checking the back of the knee. Watch this. Watch out, here comes Fallon Henley. And this gauntlet just got very interesting. Got her where she wants her. Fallon Henley letting her opponent know who's in charge. Oh, what a bump to the face! Victory nearly in hand for Lee. Got it, just a two! What does she have to do to put her away? Look at this, oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. Paying the price of truth. Takedown, slides right in, misses, and for some reason she lets go of the hold. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. There are still so many competitors left. It's hard to even focus on just one elimination here. Battling ringside now announced take. Alan Henley. Alan Henley with a hold down. Candice has got nothing left. Try and end it. Man, it's so hectic. I don't remember where we are. Order. But we have an insane amount of clashes on tap. More action on the way with Stratton headed into the gauntlet. Oh, man. The roar of this crowd has been building, and they are at a fever pitch right now. You can feel the anticipation growing with... This match. She's looking for something under the ring to even her odds here. Clearly thinking a steel chair is what's needed right about now. Oh! 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 Henley keep 
keeping her opponent at bay. Not a single person in this place is sitting down. We might just be watching one of the greatest matches we've seen in quite some time here. Placing them into the corner. If you can get past the good looks, pay attention to the athleticism. Quick shoot, Stratton Bomb. Stratton is just about to finish this. Conservation is key here as we still have a lot of entrants still waiting. And now we got Ivy Nile stepping up in this gauntlet match. And the referee gets caught in the line of fire. Oh my goodness! Boom! <laughs> Sky high! Way up there. And up the turnbuckles we go. Soaring! Tremendous impact. Cover! She pops the shoulder up in one. Giving a massive effort to overcome the pin attempt. She sent flying into the corner. High risk area up there. Up on the top row. Now to this part of town for these two competitors. This could go south in a hurry. Here we go. Super play. And Stratton is showcasing her arsenal. Ivy's uh, got to find a way to put her best foot forward here. Wow. And a drop kick. Picture perfect. <laughs> and now she delivers her back into the ring. Uh-oh. She could be setting up for a submission here. Impressive this. Oh, serious peril. No, she counters. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. You feel like hope is starting to fade away right now. She might be just moments away from tapping out. And she escapes the submission. Is losing grip of this match now. And I don't see Stratton slowing down whatsoever. She's getting fired up, ready to show her opponent what she's got. It's looking like Maurice is fired up for this gauntlet. Uh-oh, she has trouble coming. Not going to be easy to get out of this. Trapped and nowhere to go. Except for maybe the emergency room or the locker room. She breaks the hold. Side headlock applied. For a good Watch. measure. Boom! Face first! <laughs> Had scattered it. Here we go again. Maurice. Oh! The French kiss. I've seen that move before. Will that stop Stri- Why? She had it right where she wanted her. She doesn't want the suffering to end, that's why. Maurice kiss! Au revoir, Byron. Maurice might just have it. Here we go. Well, well, you have to question this decision. Oh, this gauntlet match just got more interesting with Shayna Baszler entering. It this time around.
Baszler moments away, closing. Oh my, look at this, Court. Look at this. Fighting her way out. How did she break that hole? Spectacular. Makes a cover. And an effective pin. Are you kidding me? Not even a one count. Face first. Oh, man, by the hair. Hair whip. Around the neck. Into the STO. These superstars are showing no concern for their own well-being. All that matters to them right now is doing as much damage to one another as possible. And Maurice is taking control in this match. Though I don't see Shayna struggling much longer. Oh, punishing. That will put it set up. Ah, oh, drop kick to the spine. Just breaking down the opponent. And we've got Cross heading for the gauntlet now. Oh, raking the face. Plenty of ways to get creative up on the entrance area. Also plenty of ways to get yourself seriously hurt. It's the, the mounted thrashing. My goodness. Getting ugly in there. Out of control. Maurice kiss. Au revoir, Byron. Maurice kiss.
stole the shallow end of this very deep gauntlet pool. Dropped with the cutter. She got the shoulders down. A whole herd of entrance waits backstage. This is very far from over. Now we've got Piper Niven jumping into this gauntlet. Just desperately trying to fight out of it. Forearm to the face. Oh, oh nothing fancy about that. <laughs> Up and spiked with a Michinoku driver. Did Niven end it there? Two. What a kick out of two. Nikki was almost down for the count. Almost about to meet defeat. Is there <laughs> up and spiked with a Michinoku driver? Piper got all of it. Two. Still a long road ahead with many roadblocks yet to end with the ring. So who's next? The one and only China is ready to make some noise. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh, man. Looks like your opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Smart attacking the arm. Just deadlifting right there. The power. Power slam. Cover. Shoulder up right away. She's not done yet, but you have to believe that she's still in all sorts of trouble here. It's a part and up, uh-oh, look out! Spiked with a Michinoku driver. I don't care who you are, they can't survive any more of those. How does anyone have this much in them at this point? Can't put this one away even after that big move. Did you hear the impact? Big four.
sucker opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. Elbow drop. Oh, man, check out this power. She's going for it. Here's a cover. Could be it. She breaks the ref's count. Wow. to the back of the neck. Liv is losing any kind of advantage here. Yeah, China isn't giving any quarter, any mercy. Made her pay for her mistake. It's time for Liv to take advantage of the misstep and take command. Fighting back by the counter. Lights out, DDT connects. China looking for the double underhook. Here it comes. Exclamation delivered by China. Cover. There's two. What in the world? Liv Morgan showed what she's made of there with a really impressive kick out. And now it's reload time. Time to find another moment to pull off that one more time. Escapes with a knee to the gut. Reversal on top of reversal. And China is firmly in command. Yeah, Morgan is having trouble fighting back. the top row. What a hot shot. That should do it right there. Here's Perez entering the fray in this gauntlet match. She just shocked everyone in the ring. Morgan's starting to think she might have this one in the bag. Clear she has China look. For the double underhook. Here it comes. Pedigree. That could be curtain. But jumping complete shot. Ace first. Liv could have this one. The cover. Still early in the night as there are a lot of contestants yet to enter the gauntlet. The count was stopped before it started. She kicked out there, but I don't know how much more she can take. Fed's press takes him down. <laughs> Roxanne Perez looking for pop. I can't make sense of that decision. She might have had the pinfall in hand. This is interesting with the addition of Bianca Belair to the gauntlet. or desperation in the ring now, knowing that you've tried to end this and... F no! Oh, no! Crashing hard onto the floor! No, that was a hair... Launching! <laughs> Roxanne Perez with Pop Rocks! So much brutality with that move tonight. Two! Around and around we go. I got lost in the entry pool, but believe me, this thing's far from over. Time to run the gauntlet, and DeVille looks ready.
this gauntlet just got more interesting with the arrival of Shotzi. Excited to get into this gauntlet match. The ballsy badass taking her eye off the, well, the ball here. Not sure how smart that is. She saw it coming. Shotzi kindly requests that you never wake up. It's Shotzi's opening to take this. Cover! There's two! Just when you think it's the end, she stays alive. What amazing resilience. Shotzi kindly requests that you never wake up. Going to the well again. Will it produce dividends? Two count. Still early in the night as there are a lot of contestants yet to enter the gauntlet. And Mighty Molly is really going to want to prove that she can last in this gauntlet match. At this point, this is incredibly ill-advised. You're in the middle of a match. I don't really think this is the most opportune time to be looking for the fans' praise. On the top! Wow. Can Shotzi come back from that? Two! Plenty of superstars waiting to take their turn. Lots of match left to go. Mighty Molly just looking to humiliate her opponent. Now we've got Asuka jumping into the gauntlet. Just looking to humiliate her opponent. What's she waiting for? She's looking more focused on from the top. Uh oh. I uh, got caught. No one's ready. More challengers left to go. This match is an absolute marathon. Oh, man. It's Stephanie McMahon entering the gauntlet. Ready to shake things up in this gauntlet. Here comes the setup. Double under. Double under arm hook. Blocked and countered with a vicious clothesline. 
Hoist their opponent up for a fireman's carry. Sent down into a leg drop. Very unique. Well, that clinched things for Carter. Two. Around and around we go. I got lost in the entry pool, but believe me, this thing's far from over. A Lynch looking. Ready to take over this whole gauntlet. Ooh, clothesline delivered. And I think we all know nothing good comes of fighting on the stage. Case in point, nothing good happening right now. Corey, uh -oh. pump handle, pump handle coming. Pump handle suplex. Kick to the gun, and now gonna turn things here. What a slam! It's an open drive. Is it enough? The cover! Two count. Lynch letting her opponent know who's in charge. And now we've got Rhea Ripley stepping into this gauntlet match. Oh, great. Rearranging our ringside furniture here. Clearing the announce desk. What a mess. Oh, taken down. Evades their offense. Oh, one step ahead with the suplex. Lynch saw it coming. She turns it around. One response after another. Becky in full control here. Oh, man handle slam. Becky has opened up an opportunity. What a jaw-dropping show of strength this late into the match. And with that kick out, Becky has to keep the aggression up. She can't let it phase her. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. These two trading count. Kick to the gut by Ripley. Followed by the lift tie. Wow. And frustration is starting to set in for Rhea Ripley. She's not used to this level of resilience. Oh, and a stomp right to the back. She avoids the contact. Bang! An agile escape. And Rhea is revving this crowd up. Can end this. Becky Lynch looking for it. Handle slam. Will that serve this up for Becky? We might have already had a fall if the referee wasn't out of action. And she's able to stop the count early. Incredible power to kick out at just one. You know, Becky is feeling a dissatisfaction with the outcome of that pin count. She thought she had it. A bit of provocation from Dolan. Piercing shot to the body. This is a pretty dangerous place to fight. Screens, exposed metal, ledges, so much could go wrong. Oh, ward it off with a thunderous uppercut. I oh, able to counter. Oh, there's the crucifix. Nicely done. Facing off on the top of the ramp. I don't know what's going to happen, but it's going to hurt. Kick right in the face. Oof. 
Kick to the gut. Here it comes. Rhea with the riptide. Amazingly executed once more. That's that's impossible. I, I can't believe what we just saw. Ripley needs to become a little bit more brutal to close this one out. There are a lot of ways this can go sideways. Everything on that stage looks like it hurts. Fighting back, however, punches in the midsection. Uh oh. Wow, what a move! Rhea Ripley setting up her opponent. Here it comes! Riptide! Ripley with an emphatic. Oh, come on. What benefit is there in prolonging things? Ripley with the wherewithal to counter. GG Dolan. What is she looking for? Here we go. She might just be toying with her at this point. JC Jane entering this gauntlet match. She can survive the gauntlet. Yeah. Yeah. JC Jane connects with a boot. The big gun fire, and she stops the count. She just might have more malicious intentions in mind. Whoa, look who's here. Beth Phoenix ready to run the table. A striking display from the Glamazon, but she can't get too caught up in it. The awesome power of the Glamazon. The Glam Slam! Beth might just have it. Reversal! Can she capitalize? J.C. Jane wants more from her opponent. Come on, what's going on here? Pay attention to your competition. steady and focused. Kai entering this gauntlet. Double chicken wing applied. Glam slam! Ultimate insult to injury with that stolen move. She has too much pride to go down to her own move. There's got to be some sense of desperation right now. Oh! Oh, God! That, that, that's a bad landing! Oh, that was nasty to watch. Finding nobody home. Oh, yeah. She is really getting fired up. Oh, man. Oh, man. They 
do not care who or what they destroy. Yeah, Byron, you are dangerously close to being collateral damage in this one. Broken up with a fist to the face. The Kai off the ropes. Kylo Proctor. Did Kai just put an end to this? Cover. What? You've got to be kidding me. How? How? Kicking out at one after that is unheard of. And that could have been Dakota's best shot. Dakota Kai with a bang detonation kick. Is there any life left in Beth? Cover. Kick out. I thought it was finished off for sure. Unreal. Unreal to kick out there. Not only unlikely, downright extraordinary. And that has to be a setback for Dakota. She didn't expect a kick out there. Wicked clothesline. Turns the tables. Dakota Kai turning up the intimidation factor. Dakota Kai, detonation kick. Has Dakota settled this? Just two more obstacles left in this gauntlet match. And that prevents any offense from Dakota. And JC Jane gets all of the discus big boot. This war is all but over. Makes the cover. No, oh, she kicked out. Home stays alive for Dakota Kai. The heaviest artillery has been used, but it's not enough for the three. Goodness gracious. Just insulting. And JC Jane gets all of the discus big boot. Will that do it for JC? Will that do it? Two. Coming in fresh, we've got the left. JC Jane scores the victory. The Falls Cat Anywhere matches never disappoint, but this one might go down in the annals of the WWE as one of the best ever. gauntlet is over like it or not jc jane knows how to turn up the heat when it counts and tonight it counted <laughs>